Hi everyone, welcome back to Ars Coso Kitchen. My name is Corinne Chen and I am a nutritionist from Toronto, Canada. And today I want to share a delicious probiotic parfait recipe with you. This recipe makes for a super tasty snack, but also if you have a sweet tooth, it can be a great alternative to conventional desserts, which are packed with refined sugars that have impact on your insulin levels, your energy regulation system. So this recipe in particular, we're going to be using fresh fruits, unsweetened yogurt, Ars Coso and some granola at the end to add some texture and crunch and it's all going to be packed with healthy fibers, antioxidants, protein from the yogurt and of course probiotics from our Ars Coso here. Remember that Ars Coso is made from fermenting over 100 different plant foods for over one year. So that means it captures so many micronutrients and gut boosting nutrients um, and also it's got a really great plum like sweetness that works really well in this parfait recipe so without further ado let's get to it the beauty of this recipe is that it is super easy and it doesn't require you to be very precise which is my favorite kind of recipe to be honest I love cooking from the heart and this also means you can probably make it with your kids because you don't need to be very very uh, particular or measure a lot of things um, and it can also easily be adjusted to fit dairy-free diets and I know that's something that's very important to a lot of people at home so all you're gonna need are obviously your bottle of Ars Coso a pint of your favorite uh, yogurt. I've gone with a coconut milk yogurt here. Um, I like to stay away from dairy. And of course, you can choose two fresh fruits of your choice. I have gone with a tropical theme for today. So I've got strawberries and pineapples. Um, also, the colors are so beautiful. And last but not least, you're going to need your favorite granola. Make sure you read the label so that you avoid anything with added sugar. This is a coconut chip based granola, so it's completely grain free and dairy free. And it's been sweetened with dried bananas and dried plums, which I really like because it's a whole food. So here's how it's going to go. You're going to grab a mason jar. I love mason jars because you can slap a lid on it and it can keep your uh, your finished parfait for a little bit longer. It makes it a little more portable. So you're going to grab your mason jar and you're just going to pour about a tablespoon of Ars Coso right into it. So right into the bottom there, you'll see so you've got that. And I already get that plummy aroma. So delicious. And from there, super simple, you're just gonna grab a spoon and take one of the fruits of your choice and just layer it right in there. Just dump it right in. Spread it out a little bit so it looks pretty, but other than that, it's not a science. So really anyone can do it, even your children, even your toddlers. And then after that, grab your yogurt. We're gonna add about half, half a cup, two heaping tablespoons in there. So that will be around I would say a quarter of a cup. Okay, just add that in there. You know what? I'm gonna go for one more just because I'm feeling the extra protein. And that's why this recipe is so great because it's just versatile. Okay, from there, we're gonna repeat that process again. So you're gonna add another layer of the Ars Coso in there. Again, about a tablespoon and just really swirl it in there so it looks really nice and even. And then I'm going to add my pineapples. I just love pineapples. It's got extra enzymes in addition to the ones that you're getting in your yogurt and your Ars Coso. Uh, it's got an enzyme called bromelain in there. So layering that on. And then we're going to add on another quarter cup or so, maybe a third cup of yogurt. Yeah. And the reason why we've gone with an unsweetened one is because now we can control the sweetness by how much fruit we add. So you're not at the mercy of someone else adding sugar to your food. You're the one in control. Okay, so this is kind of what it looks like. It's super pretty. You've got all the layers in there. And we're going to finish off by topping with some of those coconut chip granolas right up the top. Yeah, so that's about a third of a cup right in there. And I also like to just grab a handful of these mixed nuts that I've roasted myself for some additional crunch and healthy fatty acids so that it's a really well-rounded snack slash dessert. And look how cute that looks. It's so pretty. Um, once you dig in, go all the way to the bottom, make sure you get a little bit of each layer and then, yeah, let me know what you think. So I'm gonna grab a spoon here and I'm gonna dig right in. Oh my 
my god it looks so yummy yeah that protein yogurt some antioxidants micronutrients from the fruit and lots of fats from the nuts and seeds and we've got the ars coso coming in with all the probiotics prebiotics and postbiotics here we go mmm 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 Wow, that's so good. It's like just the right amount of sweetness. It is not going to make you want to crave more sugar. Just enough. Mmm, and the crunch is so satisfying. That was delicious. And as you can see, it was so easy to put together. So if you guys are interested in making this at home, the recipe, more information about Ars Coso are all on the Ars Coso website. I hope you give it a try because this is definitely going to be a staple for my breakfast, snack, and dessert going forward. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a great day and I'll see you guys in the next video.